Peggy 16. The time before House of Wolves, these two friends who I play games with all the time, you know, and so I knew this 3v3 thing was coming, and so my two two like buddies and I, we would play threes for hours every night, every night. And I didn't tell them what we were doing, you know, because you can't, you kind of want your friends to experience it the way that the way that players are going to. But I was like, oh, we're doing this thing. In my head, I'm like, we're doing this thing. So I want to like get the communication down, get used to playing with everyone. And we played for hours, hours and hours and hours of threes back in the day. And then Trials came out. And Trials was our Friday night. Every week, Trials, you know, we played. But it was this time where you're like, oh, I have this thing to look forward to. I have this thing to look forward to every week. This like sweaty, stressful, high stakes activity. And right now, we are missing that. And I know we're missing it. I know we are missing it. We are going to fix it. Trials is back, and it's pretty insane. When we knew that Trials was coming back, the most important thing from us was to do it right. And so that means it's, it's taken us a little while. Every single life, every single round, every single match means something in Trials, whether you win or lose. Fight, win, fight again. This is your duty. When you've got the best players in an arena and it's power enabled, the stakes are incredibly high. It is a legitimate, difficult thing to be good at. With the reintroduction of Trials of Osiris, we are really taking a look at our whole sandbox and saying, like, okay, what is the right balance of things? We want to make sure that we really stick the landing with Trials. It's important that this doesn't go out half-baked. We are in the playtest lab every day playing Trials, trying to get it just right. We've been working to balance uh, you know, the abilities, the subclasses, the weapons, the armor, to make sure it is as fun and as fair as possible. We've done a lot because it's important. We're bringing back some amazing maps from Destiny 1, some of my favorites personally. Cauldron, Exodus Blue, and Anomaly. Some of the coolest armor and weapons from Destiny 1, in my opinion, were the Trials' original gear set, and that's coming back. And when players go flawless, those armor pieces and weapons will react in a certain way. When you see someone in the tower... Everybody's gonna know. Everyone's gonna know that they went flawless that week. It's just so cool to have, like, a pinnacle PvP activity return. We're hearing it from the players. We feel it ourselves, and I can't wait to bring back a version of Trials that matches what we remember from back in Destiny 1. Go. You make me proud.